So this is the new Oxy right here desktop mode running on the lab dock. Hi, so who are you? Hello, I'm Laurent. I'm a Oxense founder and uh, we create Oxy, a new desktop user interface for Android smartphone. And uh, so right here you are showing off the BQ phone? Yes, it's Which a one is this? BQ X2 uh, Aquaris uh, Pro uh, with a, a 4 GB uh, memory and uh, we can use it as a computer. It's the Snapdragon? Yes, it's a Qualcomm Snapdragon 660. 660? And uh, so the Android is over here. Yeah. It's just a normal Android. Yeah. But what you do is when it's connected by Type C to the lab dock, you have a desktop. Yes. Desktop UI. Yes. Because also smartphone, uh, we can use uh, this dock station as a computer. And uh, what's some of the latest uh, function you have? Uh, since uh, just a few months, uh, we can now use uh, business applications inside Oxy. Uh, for example, we can uh, launch. Uh, Microsoft Word, the real uh, Microsoft Word that turns into uh, Microsoft Windows, not on Android, because on Android it's another uh, it's another window. This is and the you Android can, version. Yes, of you can compare the two. This is uh, Android uh, yeah. Word, and uh, the other one is uh, the real Word. Uh, nice. Yeah. And if I go over here, uh, you have a lot of apps. Yes. And uh, depending on the profile uh, inside your company, you can uh, have access to many applications. Like you can see here, the real PowerPoint or uh, PowerPoint Android, Gimp, Inkscape, maybe Sage, or uh, everything you need, Photoshop, Illustrator, etc. So here's some of all the apps you have right here. Um, there's... Can you run any Windows app? Yes. Uh, any Windows app you publish, uh, we can uh, have an access from Oxy uh, by the gateway. Uh, it's uh, installed uh, in the information system of the company. So we can see, for example, a full version of Chrome. Yes, yeah. you can have a, a full version of Chrome here. So this is uh, a full desktop Chrome running yes, on the Android here phone. You can see uh, the agenda of the uh, account or uh, his email. You have uh, some tabs you can open here, and, uh, and we access. have to consider that we are connecting over eight thousand miles yes. to France. Yes, we're in the U.S. This, yeah. this will be basically feel like a local computer. Yeah. Yes. 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 Here, it, it it works perfectly because we have a good connection. <laughs> yeah, we're lucky right now. We're doing a hotspot in the conference, but it's still working. And uh, so it looks great with the Chrome. You can go also full screen. I, I can use Gimp if you want. The it's, Gimp. Uh, the uh, concept uh, and uh, graphics, graphics uh, yeah. uh, application, and it resize uh, immediately to uh, take all the, yeah. the, the size place of the window. You have? window. Yeah. Can we do full screen also? Yeah, sure. So you have two different types of full screen, right? One is hiding the the bars. Yes. The Here I, I keep the uh, the menu and the bar, the status yeah. bar, and uh, I can have the full screen, and the other bar disappears. We can use uh, in. Uh, Full screen. Then now it's totally full screen, and uh, potentially the server could be very powerful, right? So what's the business model? Do you have a package for enterprise? Yes. Today we work uh, on a solution we uh, call the digital workspace for business, and uh, it's a subscri subscription. You can uh, pay for uh, each uh, user, and uh, you can use all the, uh, the application are authorized by your uh, your uh, informatic. So uh, the enterprise can buy a lab dock for 199 uh, retail price, yeah. a phone for 249 yes. or 299. Yes. And then um, and then what's it called? Uh, and you have uh, a package is a computer is a durable. You you don't have to change the uh, dock station because it uh, dure a, a long time, and you just have to change uh, sometimes the phone to have a more uh, powerful smartphone or. Uh, yeah. But then you have a monthly subscription based on how much performance you want, or there's a license fee for the for this cloud service. The license is for the cloud services, yes, to uh, to access to the application of the enterprise. And then uh, it's secure. Yes, it's uh, secure because uh, uh, all the um, flow of communications are encrypted. So uh, you have good encryption. Everything is working. I mean, yes, yes, yes. It's like enterprise level. Yeah. Yeah, we need it uh, for business. 
All right. But how about for uh, single users like me? Uh, I want to do some Windows apps and stuff. Uh, and I'm not an enterprise, right? Yes, I know. So maybe you will have something going on for that too? <laughs> yes, well, not now, because uh, our first focus is for uh, our companies. But uh, in few months, maybe uh, at the end of this year, we can uh, think to uh, create a platform for uh, uh, everybody. And uh, we have just to uh, uh, create a, uh, a new environment uh, to secure every user uh, depending on uh, what, uh, what they want as uh, applications and if they want to uh, have a storage to, uh, to have their data inside. So uh, it, it could be in the cloud, it could be uh, potentially lots of storage shared by the company yes, or everyone sure. gets their own storage? Yes, or, uh, you, you, you can have a storage like a Box, OneDrive, Google Drive, uh, Anything, anything you need. And if I do 4K video editing, I want faster CPU. I can upgrade to the faster one. I can downgrade. Uh, potentially we, all this. We we uh, ensure you you have uh, the level uh, of uh, power you need to uh, to launch all your applications. But the solution you have for the enterprise, the enterprise have their own server. Yeah, sure. So, so they, we just have to just install. A... Uh, we just have to install a gateway. Uh, the uh, company publish his application. And the gateway is uh, there to uh, uh, enable the connection uh, from the smartphone and the account uh, in the smartphone to this gateway and the uh, enterprise applications. So, um, so what is it? What is uh, is the industry standard for how enterprises have servers? And, yes. And the host is a Windows server. On yes, the yes. Active Directory servers VM? and uh, uh, application servers to publish. Uh, uh, to publish by uh, RDP or uh, nice. Yeah. So, what do you think about the lab doc? This is one of the first uh, what's it called prototypes. What do you think about the build so far? Oh, the, this this lab doc is yeah. very uh, nice. Uh, the the touch and uh, the feel of the keyboard, the touchpad, everything here you can use. Uh, you can use it's very comfortable. It's a nice product. Yeah. So. You, could, you think you could do all your work with this? Yes, yes. So it'd be great if um, we can actually, you know, do everything with this. Any yes, app, you, you can. I want to do my yes. uh, Adobe Premiere. You, you can also play if you want. Uh, there is not only uh, application for work. You Games? Can. Yes. All right. Um, That's cool. All right. So looking forward to what happens next. and. Uh, this is the BQ phone. Uh, have you been looking at different solutions, right? Yes, we we, get more we work with uh, maybe 20 uh, smartphones today, our display port or display link. And uh, uh, we work with a powerful smartphone, it was the essential phone, but now uh, there is no more essential phone. But it works very well. And uh, today, the, the best uh, solution is maybe the BQ. Because it's affordable, it's, it's not affordable too expensive, and, and it's powerful. Uh, no, nothing to, to say. This is uh, the perfect uh, smartphone for that moment. What I'm hoping is 2019. Every new smartphone is going to have uh, this kind of functionality, DisplayPort Alt mode, uh, to be able to do this kind of stuff. But to have Oxy running, it's uh, maybe a partnership with this phone maker. Or you, you have to modify the, the firmware to add yes, your we have to we have to modify the uh, the source code the uh, AOSP or uh, but uh, we can uh, we can work with uh, some uh, community uh, ROM like uh, Lineage OS uh, so we have many possibilities uh, today we publish some uh, ROM on uh, uh, getoxy.com. Uh, it's the old version of Oxy and we publish the new in few uh, weeks. Uh, right. On this website, for which phone will be for the new version? Maybe uh, for uh, BQ, for uh, Samsung, for uh, maybe Huawei, for uh, LG. Uh, every smartphone you you know with a DisplayPort uh, connector, we can uh, publish uh, a new ROM, and we um, we search maybe to to uh, have a partnership with by default. When you buy the phone, it's there. It's, yeah, that's the dream, right? That's the dream. Like the Oxy phone. Yes, that's, that's, a, that's a dream. It will be. This should be a lot of Oxy phone this year, hopefully. Hopefully. <laughs> All right. Hope you do some good networking, talking with all the companies, smartphone companies, 
Yeah. And you get some signed some contract so you can ship this. Yes, yes, we 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 just we have some discussion. We we don't we can today speak uh, about these uh, negotiations, but we have some maybe some partner uh, this year uh, for um, standard smartphone and for rugged smartphone. Nice. And I hope also my dream will be the Cosmo Communicator yes. with Oxy. That would be so cool. <laughs> yes, yes. That's a really nice phone. We, we I just have... hope they get DP to work, DisplayPort. No, it's not DisplayPort, the uh, Gemini, but uh, they have their own uh, uh, connector. Yeah. Uh, they work well. We, we have uh, tested and uh, we hope to present uh, a partnership with, between uh, Planet Computers and Oxense for the yeah. Mobile World Congress at Barcelona. Yeah, and Gemini PDA, has, they have their own system going on, the HDMI alt mode, I think, something like that. But uh, maybe the Cosmo Communicator potentially could have, it's just a just, just DP, maybe. Maybe, That's it's fun. a possibility, oh, yes. All right. Cool.